and made in China. Miao Ho is from Shehong, China. Following this year's Burning Man team, Animalia, that celebrates the animal world, she brings to the playa an 8-meter tall metal sculpture of a bunny. Uh, you can see this rabbit. The idea of the creation comes from Chinese lunar year of the rabbit, from Chinese history. It has been passed down for thousands of years, that every 12 years is a repeat. This year happens to be rabbit, and animals are the Burning Man's theme this year. I think rabbit can represent warmth and love. Artist Ma Jin shipped this interactive installation in the shape of a giant jellyfish all the way from Shanghai, China. The artwork reads two Chinese characters, not yet and coming. Ma Jin says it expresses his concerns for the future of the planet and the environment. Jellyfish is a very, very, very simple animal. But uh, it uh, needs water will be very clean. It can be live. So if we have a very nice future, we need protect our water. Nikki Shong, an immigrant from China, now living in San Francisco, created this piece called My Heart Will Go On, inspired by the Titanic theme song of the same name to honor the resilience of people's kindness in tough times like the pandemic and to fight the stereotypes that she says Chinese people are often subjected to. Because of the news, there are some impressions formed about China and Chinese people, and I think it's important to use art as a tool to express and let them know who we are and what we care about and what we're passionate about. And we are uh, just connecting uh, as a human as a, uh, on, the, on the level, just everybody, regardless of nationality and race. Xiao Xiao Dao from Yunnan province in China brought an eight-armed noja, a figure from ancient Chinese mythology with three heads and eight arms playing with fire. What I want with this piece of artwork, Eight Armed Nuja, is to express the kind of freedom that Chinese rock and roll has. I feel that Nuja is very rock and roll. Rock and roll is kind of a spirit, but at its inner core, it's all about one word, freedom. Since Friday's torrential rains and flooding prompted organizers to close access to Burning Man, it's unclear what will happen to many of the installations that were supposed to be ignited this weekend, including the famous sculpture of Burning Man. Right now, participants stranded by the flooding are waiting for it to end, so they can go home. Jenny Adulo, VOA News, Black Rock City.